There are strange things done in the midnight sun by the men who boil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that it make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was that night on the marge of Lake Labarge. I cremated Sam McGee. Now Sam McGee was from Tennessee, where the cotton blooms and blows. Why he left his home in the south to roam round the pole, God only knows. He was always cold, but the land of gold seemed to hold him like a spell. But he'd often say in his homely way that he'd sooner live in hell. On a Christmas day, we were mushing our way over the Dawson Trail, talking a cold. Through the parky's fold, it stabbed like a driven nail. If our eyes we closed, then the lashes froze, till sometimes we couldn't see. <laughs> it wasn't much fun, but the only one to whimper was Sam McGee. And that very night, as we lay packed tight in our robes beneath the snow, and the dogs were fed, and the stars overhead were dancing heel and toe, he turned to me and, uh, Cap, says he, I'll cash in this trip, I guess. And if I do, I'm asking that you won't refuse my last request. Well, he seemed so low, I just couldn't say no. Then he says we're sort of moon. It's the cursed cold, and it's got right hold, till I'm chilled, clean through to the bone. To date being dead, it's me awful dread of, of the icy grieve that pains. And I want you to swear that foul or fair, you cremate me last remains. Well, a pal's last need is a thing to heed, so I swore I would not fail. And we started on at the streak of dawn. But God, he looked ghastly pale. He crouched on the sleigh. And he raved all day. Oh, his home in Tennessee. And before nightfall, a corpse was all that was left for Sam McGee. There wasn't a breath in that land of death, and I hurried, horror-driven, with a corpse half hid that I couldn't get rid because of a promise given. It was lashed to the sleigh, and it seemed to say, you may tax your brave brawn and brains, but you promise true. And it's up to you to cremate them last remains. Now, a promise made is a debt unpaid. And the trail has its own stern code in the days to come. Although my lips were dumb in my heart, how I cursed that load. In the long, long night, by the moon firelight, while the huskies round in a ring hold out their walls to the homeless snows. Oh, God, how I loathe the thing. And every day that quiet clay seemed to heavy and heavier grow. But on I went, though the dogs were spent and the grub was getting low. Trail was bad. Oh, I felt half mad, 
but I swore I wouldn't give in. And I'd often sing to the hateful thing, and it hearkened away a grin. Till I came to the marge of Lake Barge, and the derry lake that lay. It was jammed in the ice, but I saw in a trice it was called the Alice May. So I looked at it, and I thought of it, and I looked at my frozen chum. Then here's his eye with a sudden cry. Is my crematorium. Some planks I tore from the cabin floor. I lit the boiler fire. Some coal I found that was lying round. And I heaped the furnace higher. The flames just soared. The furnace roared. Such a blaze you seldom see. Then I burrowed a hole in the glowing coal, and I stuffed in Sam McGee. Then I made a hike, for I didn't like to hear him sizzle so, and the heavens scowled, and the huskies howled, and the wind began to blow. Oh, it was icy cold, but the hot sweat rolled down my cheeks, and I don't know why. And the greasy smoke in an inky cloak went a streaking down the sky. Well, I don't know how long in the snow I just wrestled with grisly fear. But the stars came out, and they danced about, ere again I ventured near. I was sick with rain, but I bravely said, I, I just take a peep inside. I guess he's cooked. It's time I looked. Then the door I opened wide. And there sat Sam, looking cool and calm in the heart of the furnace roar. And say, he wore a smile you could see a mile, and he says, Please close that door. It's fine in here. But I uh, sort of here, you let in the cold and the storm. Since I left Plum Tree down in Tennessee, it's the first time I've been warm. <laughs>